Hi, I'm Emma Baker. And I'm Olivia Baker. And this is our new segment, Baking with the Bakers. And so today we're going to be making a cookie dough dip. And what you'll need for this recipe is one stick of butter, eight ounces of cream cheese, some sugar, some dark brown sugar, some salt, some vanilla extract, and I recommend mini chocolate chips, but you can use whatever chocolate chip you desire. And then you'll need a large bowl, a hand mixer or a stand mixer, or you can do it with a wooden spoon, just something to mix it with. You're measuring cups, measuring spoons. And then we're just using a bowl to soften our cream cheese and butter. So what your first step is, is you wanna make sure your butter and cream cheese are soft. The best way I find to do that is to pop it in the microwave for about 15 seconds. So you wanna put your You take your butter, put that in the bowl, the other way, and your cream cheese, and you just open packages, microwave for 15 seconds. So just microwave it until it's not melted, but like it looks soft, and like if you like poke it with like a spatula or something, it's gonna like be boy. <laughs> Okay, stop. Okay, stop it at 45 seconds. Or don't. And then, sorry. I find it best if you wash your hands after you handle the butter so you don't have grease all over your hands so it doesn't mess with any of the other recipe. Are you filming me washing my hands? Nice. That's the, that's the true tea. It's true TV. <clears throat> so then you have your butter and cream cheese and you can see that if you stab it like with a spatula it's going to easily go in so then you just take get it out the best you can from the bowl and put it in your larger bowl that you're going to use for mixing And then I also find it best if you put a paper towel down on your workstation so that you don't get anything all over the counter. And then, okay, yes, yes, okay. So then, fourth cup of brown sugar. So you're gonna have a fourth a cup of brown sugar and a third of a cup of pure, just granulated sugar. and make sure you pack it, and make sure the brown sugar is packed. It's fine, I'm not gonna die. Okay. Then you can put this. Okay, so then you're gonna take, I'm using a hand mixer, and you just beat, the butter, cream cheese, brown sugar, and sugar together. And so then you're going to scrape down the sides of your mixture. Okay, like that. And then you're going to take the vanilla and salt and you're going to have a half teaspoon of salt. about that much and then two and a half teaspoons of vanilla And then you take that and you 
should be done with your measuring cups. And then you can, for this part, you can like fold it in or you can mix it. Either one works. done with your pan mixer. So then see, make sure all the sides are scraped down. Then can I have a chocolate chips? Can I have those? Can I have chips? Okay. So do something. About one and a half cups of chocolate chips, but if you want more, then have more, and if you want less, then have less. Do one and a half of those. And after they're folded in evenly throughout the mix, then okay. Then you can take your bowl, this is a very big bowl, and just turn your and put your cookie dough dip in your storage container. want to keep your cookie dough chilled until you're ready to consume it but I also recommend chilling it for about 20 to 30 minutes before you eat it seeing as the cream cheese and butter are going to be are going to be very soft so then you just Pop it in the fridge and then just, I'd recommend using just something to dip when you want to enjoy it and that's how you make your cookie dough.